guys what's up this is exotic fishing and this is my first video i'm gonna be showing you around all my tanks and just telling what my whole channels are gonna be out be about and stuff so this is my first tank i had 10 little black mollies in here but they all died and so that's the last one left and then i have this big pleco right here pleco uh he was getting bullied in my other tank so i'm you guys will get to see this video i'm gonna move him to my other tank which i'll also show you and then i have this little small four gallon uh glowfish tank um i lost the glow light sadly so it's just a tank so what i'm gonna do i think i'm gonna make this a beta tank and then make this for like my one molly and then something else in there maybe a quarry cat or something like that something cool but right i don't know if you guys can see it but yeah right there I got a, ple a pleco, another pleco. It's a different, I think it might be a bristle nose. This one's just a common, but this is a bristle nose, I'm pretty sure. So real quick, I'm gonna go show you guys the other tank. My other tank, it is a 32, I'm pretty sure. I have a beautiful flower horn right here. Oh, sorry. I'm pretty sure that uh, it's a female. It's pretty cool. As you can see, it's starting to grow like the red belly and stuff. But when we got it, it was like, probably like that big. But now look how big it is. Go sideways. Compared to my hand, it's like, he's gone pretty big. His name's Gerald and he's a pretty cool fish. And here is my other tank. Oh, here's our pet pig. <laughs> Say hi, Artie. All right, here's our other tank. This one is a, 75 it might be looking a little bit dirty i just did a water change today and i just haven't had the extra time to fill it up so it looks a little bit dirty so here i have up top i have two marine land bio wheel filters i have another i think this is aquion heater 200 watt and another 200 watt and here i have an albino oscar and you barely see him but I'm pretty sure that's a red ear sunfish. It's just real dark in here. When we caught it, we all thought it was a bass, but then the, like the pattern and the colors have come out and it looks more like a sunfish. So that's what I think it is. And here's our, our Oscar and our sunfish and our 75 gallon. I can't get all that in the screen, but we're gonna move the, the Pleco real quick into this big tank because he's been getting bullied by the flower horn over there and I learned the hard way that you can't keep a fish with it. So yeah, we're about to go move them. And let's go upstairs. All right, we're ready to move the Pleco. Also, I forgot to show you. This is my bearded dragon. Her name's Ozzy. And she'll probably eat real quick. I just have this cricket bucket. I got these a couple days ago and they're already almost gone. Some just died right off the bat. Here, let's find an alive one. We got our cricket right there. Just, just watch this. Boom. Gone. What a beast. <laughs> All right, so now it's time to move the Pleco. Um, I've done this already today. It's kind of difficult just because he's real fast. Dang, he's massive. So, uh, I'm... I gotta record this one, so it might be a little bit bad, as you can already tell. And my net's also way too small. So, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, he's going crazy. Bro, chill, chill. I'm not gonna hurt you. Yeah, as you can see, his fin's right there. That's where he's been getting nipped at by the flower horn. It's pretty bad. I might have to go get my big nut. Come on. Just make this easy on me. Come on. I can get under him. Oh, yep, we're gonna probably have to get the big nut. Let's go do that real quick. 
quick little tour. Oh, that's messy. Hold on, look at that. Do you know where my big net is? Ah, here it is. We got the big net. It'll probably like barely even fit inside the tank. <laughs> All right, he's already gone crazy, so try not to spook him out too much more than he already is. You remember this nut, don't you? All right. No. This is so much harder because they can just suck onto the wall. Look how beautiful that is. All right. Oh, dang. All right. I'm right here. Give him a little bit more water. Alright, let's go. He's a big boy. I've heard that plecos can go a while without some water. So we should be. He should be good to just walk right down over here. Um, the waters are the same temperature, so I'm gonna just drop him right in. We'll have to open this up. Goodness. Alright, here he is. Oh, I hope that he doesn't get stuck in the net. There he goes. Look at that. That's one beast right there. Those things are so cool. Alright. that on all right guys there's a little bit of a challenge if we can get this video to I'd say 20 likes I will do a video where I go around and feed every single fish in my house um, I'm working on getting a beta tank that little tank right there I don't know if I told you guys already but I'm gonna make that a beta tank um, or any just fish tank and then I think I'm going to get a beta tank for my sister. So you guys will see a video on that coming soon. Um, if the likes don't come, like if, if the likes aren't there, then my, my next video would probably be either the beta tank, getting one for my sister, or just fit going out and fishing with a friend. So, yeah. Uh, subscribe, smash that like button, and hit the notifications. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day.